Um, they both got their chances. I mean, um, Penjo will very much see how, what Mr. McManus has got, what else he's got going in it. Um, he ran well there last year on ground that was way too soft. I think he was 12th or 13th, just didn't quite get home. But he jumps, um, like he's looking a great horse for those fences. But he probably needs decent ground. Um, and Dropout Joe, yeah, that's been the plan for a long time. He did get himself injured in the field back in the end of last summer. And he, he'll be a race against time. Um, he certainly, I've always thought him to be a national horse, whether it's this year or next year, it's a different matter. We'll make a decision in about a month's time. Um, you know, at the moment he's ticking along nicely, but um, yeah, you need to be on 110% form to be going there, and if he's not, we won't. And what will they do between now and then? Will you school them over national fences? Oh yeah, they've done that before already. Um, you know, as I said, Dropout Joe is, is, is a case of getting him there. And Pendra, I'm hoping he might run at Cheltenham beforehand. It'll be a good warm-up. He hasn't run this season. Um, they both had niggling, he's had niggling problems as well, but you know, hopefully he'll get there, he'll go to Cheltenham and then maybe go on to, go on to Aintree.